Welcome to No Delivery. A very interesting sounding game, and just the demo, but it sounded really interesting. Apparently it's like roguelike and just let me read the game's per page. It actually it genuinely sounds interesting. Just take my word for it. Oh, let me give me a second though. I gotta get back to the game store page. Okay. No delivery. No delivery is a procedurally generated CRPG, combat RPG. At least I presume it's combat RPG. Or maybe it's something else. Challenging turn-based RPG combat, procedurally generated dungeons, high employee turnover rate, financial management for a haunted restaurant, and business lingo. Um, you're the newest long line of employees for a local decrepit pizza parlor. Not to be confused with FNAF. Despite the rumors, shady business history, and missing persons cases, you sign up for the night shift because it pays slightly more, and all the kids' birthday parties should have ended by then. It just sounds, it sounds good. And it looks like the the developers put a lot of custom work into it, so it's not like just that that annoying thing I hate of everything looks like it's just you know placeholders and royalty free assets that just come with the RPG Maker engine. But either way, let's get into it. I'm super stoked. What's options though? Always dash. Eh, nah. New game. Trigger warning. Oh, I'm already fucking triggered. This game contains flashing, strobing lights and effects. Ah, not, not that kind of triggering. You may toggle the filter accordingly. Filter can be changed during gameplay. Oh, what? Oh dear. Hmm. Uh, hmm. You may toggle the filter accordingly. Filter can be changed during gameplay. Hmm. I'll have it off for now, but I'm going to see if it adds to the immersion. Having a filter would make it so it takes a lot longer to render, especially, and I don't like long rendering. Del no delivery is about making the most of your impending doom. You will not always be equipped for the encounters ahead, and escape may be the only viable option. Employees will be will die, and your progress and actions are permanent. This game supports an autosave feature. Please do not close the game when the below pizza icon is visible. It gives me the almost f freaking uh, fear and hunger vibes by saying that people will die and running may be your only option. Because that's sort of the mentality you have to have in Fear and Hunger. Okay, well that kind of warning actually makes me a little more hyped. Okay. Training video, congratulations! If you're viewing this tape, that means you were recently hired as our latest employee. Before getting started, here are a few fundamental elements of employment all aspiring employees should know. Professionalism deals with how you conduct yourself among the guests and your peers. Always willing to please, a professional employee knows the best way to navigate social situations. All within policy limits, of course. Competence refers to the level of technical skill and the ability to follow directions. This ranges from serving orders on time to the rate the dishes are washed. A model employee always gets the deed done, no matter how dirty. Oh, <laughs> fun! And lastly, fun is the length is the lengths an employee is willing to go to create a family-friendly environment. Ski. This includes making the guests feel invited and welcome to the dine to dine with us. This is to create the festive, controlled environment we are known for. Now that you understand the fundamental elements of employment, you'll be ready to tackle anything that comes your way. Again, congratulations on making it to the team. And remember, your safety as an employee is her number one guarantee. I believe them. <laughs> I totally believe them, especially when given a warning saying, Hey, not everyone's going to survive. Hmm. Looks like some buck teeth. Why is there a person hanging already where I'm starting? Okay, so let's see. Toggle fill. Ooh. Hmm. It feels unnecessary right now. I'll flip it from time to time and play for. Oh. 2020 professionalism, competence. Oh, I can raise my skills. I'm. I'm guessing though, it might have to do like professional, like sort of like lonely muffin or professionalism might be strength, and competence and fun. Liability none. Fear level. I'm already terrified, and I was just hired. Confirm, cancel, yeah, and uh, yeah. Ship to dash. Just as expected. Why is there hanging bodies everywhere here? Is there any items in the toilets? Any Anything? Why am I terrified? What are my skills? I have no items, I have no skills, and we're kind of fucked. Oh, 
What? You are here. Professionalism? PCF. What? Keep going? Oh, wait. An abandoned trash bag. It twitches ever so slightly. Uh-oh. Hey. I didn't say to open it. The bag wiggles ever so slightly. <laughs> what is this? Wait, is it a battle? Delivery boy 28. I will escape. Can't escape! It writhed and it hurt me by writhing? Can't escape! It's a garbage bag! Run! What are you doing? <laughs> it's all a successful escape. Okay. You escape further into the establishment. Keep going. So, F. It, what. The, going through the whole thing will mean I have fun? Am I gonna find any items, maybe? Oh, pizza. A pizza with a slip sign? An unsightly mess blocks your way. Should you clean it up? Use your hands? Oh, broom. No brooms in your inventory. Oh, and that's it. No. Oh, no, but I, I don't have the HP for this shit. What? Can I find a broom in this this trash area? Maybe I should have had a broom. Or maybe not expected to have a broom. Yeah, I have only 7 HP now. Am I not meant to survive? What if I call it quits? It's supposed to be procedurally generated. If it's supposed to be maybe like roguelike, then I'd presume if I call it quits, I start again but with more skills. It's better than dying. So let's see if we call it quits. Don't know the way back. What? But. Oh, okay. Oh. Can we just walk by it, please? It looks to be some kind of body bag. It twitches, it twitches ever so slightly. I'm, I'm probably meant to die. Oh boy. The body wiggles ever so. The bag body. It's multiple appendages squirming around. Oh boy, please escape. It's probably gonna do more damage than the first one. Ah, uh, I should maybe be able to escape before dying. Oh, nice. You escape further into the establishment. Can I please leave? There's no way I can survive this. You don't know the way back. Maybe this is like a checkpoint? Hide. How? A drive through menu, a strange sight considering it's outside the pizzeria. May you take your order? Uh, look at the menu. Oh. I'd like food, but thank you, come again. I don't have any... I'm... I'm going to presume I could be gathering things from the trash. But I haven't seen anything, I haven't been given anything. Like... How can I just have nothing this whole entire time? Keep keep going, I guess. Am I just missing things? I'm gonna clean. Hey, I'm gonna use my hands to clean it up and then die. Okay. Let's die. Huh? One HP. Okay. And just no items. Can I please leave? How do you not know? This, this kid... It's like minimum wage, but this kid is clearly... special in the head. Uh, they don't know the way back. It's like... Oh, 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 oh. Yes. Please don't be evil. You find a lone gift box. I'm taking... Fuck, I'm risking it. I don't care. Sticking your hand inside, you feel something. You pull it in. Oh, oh. What? It's a garbage bag! Oh my... Can't escape. Oh, oh, oh. Escape, please! Oh. You escape for... Seriously. I don't know how I'm still alive, even. How, how am I... What, what is... Okay. Yes. Don't be an evil trash bag again, please. You can please be something useful. Walk inside, please. Yes. Pull me up. Really?! Is everything just fucking evil? Oh, oh, successful. If I successfully escape, it's just, I... It means I don't get anything that was... Oh my god, I, I can't. Well, I'm gonna die and... S Unless it's wiggling pizza, maybe. Please escape. Wow, okay. 
RNGs in my favor. RNGs, thank you. Can I have run? Okay. I'm so close. I shouldn't be alive. What? See, like, what if we turn on the filter? Maybe the filter would be more better. Uh, if I can just... A replica of one of the animatronics inside. Seeing it here brings some squeaky clean. H oh, H. Oops. No, I don't want to communicate with. It. We're going to survive after all. Maybe the maybe this was intended. Like it made you. Maybe it was intended that everyone who's doing this just it puts you on edge, thinking you're about to die, but you're not. No. It can be eaten to restore health or thrown to prove a point. Used to gain plus one trash and plus one dish. Huh. Okay, well, we made it to the establishment. We <laughs> call it quits right out there. Uh, if we made it to the store, might as well just keep going. Oh. What? 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 Something rises from the dumpster. This is the first day on the job. This grab. No, thank you. No, it's too damage. It's nothing. No okay. crime. You managed to escape from the monster. Manager's console. Oh, Jesus Christ! Employee. Current employee. Delivery boy. Fire them. Personal file. Oh, okay, that was weird. Wrong turns, what? What, the f what does that mean? Wait, what? It definitely does have actual FNAF. Uh, what? No. How do I... F it doesn't let me look at it. I don't know if that's just a bug. Oh, fuck, it's a star shift, yes. Just, I, 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 don't, I don't even know what's happening, but... Probably best to throw it away properly. How about no? Best to be collected and disposed of, maybe used to get some loose change. I start like the shitty ass bathroom, I don't know man. A dirty imprint of a stool, it may have been used to reach the window. Huh. The yellow tape bars entry, it's stronger than it looks. Miss Murr! It's a Trash for green stuff. Bring more soon. Okay. Strands of long hair can be found all over the sink. You got razor. Ooh, is that a weapon? A small blade worn away from shaving, popular among employees who had to use hair nets. I don't trust using it. I have absolutely no idea about anything. I don't have a broom, so I'm not going to bother with that. Locked. Wait, I can go behind it? Or no. The vending machine is a familiar sight. Take a look, yes. Oh, there's, there's pizza. There's fucking pizza in the vending machine, okay. So how much will he give me if I give him all the pizza I have now? You got five dollars. Bring more soon. Okay, I'm kind of curious, though. Maybe used to get some loose change, but I swear it... I just, I don't know, let's keep giving it. I was thinking there was an alternative for the trash, but it's just... Uh, I'm not sure if there's other places I could carry the trash. Like, maybe the trash can be used to upgrade my skills, since, like, say, if you look at the employee file. Competence, fun, and professionalism. I'm not sure how I get those. Could be for doing a good job, like, you know, cleaning this pizza floor. But I don't have a broom. So I'm just... does not open from this side. We should buy some pizza. Five dollars though, Jesus. I'm not gonna buy it until I know if it broom's gonna cost me then. Okay, maybe I'm gonna have to clean this up. A wet floor sign. It's probably used to cover up messes, and it says that can be cleaned up anyway. But, okay, it doesn't tell me I can clean it. 
Um, should I? Weird. What does the game want me to do then? If this door is locked. Oh, use the razor. Okay. Makes sense. Yeah, I'll just stick with the... Wait, what? Weird. I'll just stick with the filter, even though it would cost... It'd take longer to render shit, but... Something is clogging the toilet. We're gonna investigate. Sticking your hand inside, you strangely feel two objects floating around. Uh... Soft was it gonna be poo? Upon pulling out, you see long strands of hair surface on the water. Don't tell me the toilet, like, flushed me to death or something. Okay, well, nope. Gurgle, gurgle. Ah, uh, yeah, just, 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 just escape, please. Can't escape. Why does everything, like, fucking rise? Crap! Holy shit! No! Get over. Can't just dunk on. One more grab and I'm dead. Come on. Okay. Nope. Okay, well, I'm dead. Party's over. Oh, okay. Severance fee, fifty dollars. Another life is claimed, but its halls remain uns unsatiated. Establishment beckons. All debts must be repaid, but today is not that day. Do not disappoint me. You got fifty dollars. Oh. Security guard, professionalism two. Competence, four. Fun, one. Liability, six finger, plus one comp. What? What? What if I could just fire them? Fire, yeah. What? I'm so confused. I feel like I should be given a little more information. I don't know. Do we have actually skills? What was I supposed to do as that beginner employee? Could I have even survived? What? It's procedurally generated, but what's, what's with the shifts and the different characters? I'm so confused. We have a handgun, a flashlight, and a taser. I'm more equipped. Yeah, start the night. But why? Why am I just a completely different character with different abilities and trash? And I mean, actually, this feels like the same items I had before. It's just a different character. Who also has skills. So I should have the capacity, I think, to fight back. These have skills where the other one didn't. But was it meant that I should have died and then I would have been replaced? Alright, let's, let's investigate. Let's grab the hard thing instead. The closet key, yeah. Okay, well, okay, so the soft just makes it so you basically have a risk of dying. But at the same time, oh jeez, it's a possibility. Like, 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 if we fight that thing, we get the gift. But well, can we get the gift from this way? No, I'm a little curious. I want to see if this guy has skills or not. Poke it. Hmm. Is someone there? Listen, I know what this looks like. Please don't cut me loose. I'm still in the middle of hardening. Just a little more. I can go outside. Any moment now. Weird. Personal dossier for the delivery boy position. Probably got lost over time. It contains info on the standards and regulation employees must abide by. Inside is a Warren Martial Arts manual from the new... Ah, so if I would have survived as the delivery boy, this maybe would have been him for him. So he'd stop being a useless piece of shit and being so he could only escape. It was strangely entertaining to read. Employment standards raised. New delivery boy, sewer rat style. It's required that all present and future employees... In the position. Know this skill ensures stronger employees in the position. What? Huh. Weird, but... Okay. It's a foldable... No, let's leave it for now. He wants to... Fuck it. When I... If I replay this, just to see... If, as a delivery boy, I can survive through the whole fight. Because I have... I'm complete... I'm... I'm so confused with what is expected of me. Um, like, it's just a demo. 
It's like FNAF and maybe like Fear and Hunger and a bunch of other things. I'm just so confused. But I'll if I'm replaying the demo and there's different endings for the demo or different results or things to learn, like say getting that karate book would make it so maybe I can uh, I don't know, see something different because I don't lose that character and become the security guard. I'll probably replay and see if anything changes if I don't die once. But I'm gonna I'm just gonna I'm just gonna cut this. Yeah, just let's go with this. Let's see what happens. The bag wiggles. Ah, so we can attack, we can use a skill. Brought in from home, never know when you might need it. Mildly inaccurate, but gets the job done. Flicker your lights to disorient the target, higher chance to stun. Use your company issued taser to shock foes into submission, chance to stun. Nice. Might have to... I don't want to risk the handgun if it's, like, super powerful. I'll try the taser out. Or I can't. Shit. Mm. Alright, just keep attacking, I guess. I'll see if I gain experience or more skills to confidence by winning against this creature. It's a very strange game, though. Man, like the first enemy so in a garbage bag, I'm already like losing to it. Come on, no ma oh no, come on, you're kidding me. Okay, well... Okay, well... Do you really? Oh, come on, don't... Stop missing! Seriously! There we go, back to work, trash found. Not for trash? Three brooms, nice! Maybe I can do my job now. Yes! Body tape left over from an investigation a long time ago. Whoop. Gurgle, gurgle. You are haunted by the drowned waiter, can now be summoned when needed. Oh, so that was the thing that was in the toilet. Okay. Oh, I would like some food. Yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So why does it move? I don't know, whatever. Let's see. Get feet, 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 six, six. You got trash and dish. So they gave me like an allowance of $60 or $50, but $10 from the previous. It's just kind of weird because... I got abilities with this guy, but I can't use it. I don't know why or why not. And I kept my shit from my previous life as the delivery kid. I'm so confused with this system. It like it's it's unconventional. So being my usual self, I have to really brainstorm what the fuck the games the the developers. You know uh, what am I thinking? The developers style like what what is he trying to create and trying to grasp and then wrap my mind around it wait i don't think i needed to do that yeah okay well anyways i'll give the trash and get more money the other weird thing especially though is it said i can summon the the dead lady raises employment standards i don't know it's Oh, things carry on from previous lives, that there are different lives. There's just so many confusing things about this, but anyways, let's take the stool. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. We have the folding stool. The game will probably want us to crawl in there, but we could use it in the bathroom. Perhaps. Eh. Ah, but why would I? I'd want to stay in the building. Fuck. Shit. There's two paths now. I don't like multiple paths. God damn. It pre go, go inside. It'd be a big fat note for me. The game probably doesn't want me doing this, and it'll probably cause me death. A stench flows through the metal passage. is quite raunchy. Yes. There's some kind of movement besides your own. Oh, good warning. But hey, let's keep going. Something softly grips your leg as you crawl. Keep going. Yeah. 
You start smelling fresh air, the other side might be close. Huh? All that foreshadowing and... What the fuck is that? There's a fucking clown out there? Alrighty then. It's a one-way... One-way! One okay. Flashcards, zero detail, okay. Wait, what? Angry guest protocol. Angry guest protocol. In the event of a disgruntled customer begins to cause trouble, control the situation. Find the cause of the issue, say yes. <laughs> Just say yes. Serve any substitutes in stock. Congratulations. You've now learned how to sub subterfuge, subterfuge to avert a messy situation. Wrong order protocol. In the event a guest does not receive what they order, do not attempt to remedy the issue by preparing the correct order. Instead, let the guest cool off and immerse themselves in the restaurant environment and then proceed to serve whatever's in stock. Congratulations. If the guest is still there, they are willing and able to come back for seconds. If not, that means they were taken care of. Hmm. Birthday protocol. Reserve parties like birthdays call for special treatment. Guests must be placed in the auditorium where they will be treated to a special birthday routine by the on-stage cast. The song must be performed for the entire duration of the party. Congratulations, you provided special birthday activities for our guests and prevented another incident. Okay then. Ah, oh, what's that thing? This one has an older person still putting on their dentures. Gross. Okay. Does, it, does this... you want trash? For greens... Eh, yeah, okay, he still wants the same amount of trash, whatever. It's money. Can't complain about money. I have, uh... Oh. Ow. Okay, don't look at your file while talking to the trash, or... So that's just a bug I think the developer will need to work out on. Let's see. I have to look at money through... Wait, where's my money? Where do I look up my money? Oh, there it is. 55. It's a mascot animatronic. Rehearsal protocol engaged. Ooh. Another one of you. Standard operation requires surfaces clean of foreign contaminants. <laughs> if you see another one of me, you mind cleaning us up? We'll give you something nice in return. Oh, HP restore. Weird. Employee of the month has a picture of a guy who must have sneezed when it was taken. The plaque says employee of the month. There's a picture of a thumb. Covering the lens. You can only see a pair of fuzzy feet at the bottom. The plaque says, Employee of the Month. Picture of a backdrop. Probably is just yet to be determined. Alright, I'm gonna leave it here. I'm confused as fucking hell. The game has autosave, but... Like, what would have happened if I went out the window? And... What if I just survived this the first? I have many questions, and I don't... I, won't, I probably won't be getting the answers anytime soon. Just like in Fear and Hunger, I play ignorantly... Both because I have no choice, and because it's a brand new game, there's no walkthroughs, no one understands anything about the game, and I have to dive in oblivious to everything. So hey, I hope you enjoyed and look forward to more of this game, no delivery, and the demo. Just, just look forward to more, because it's an interesting game, it's different, who knows, maybe, maybe it'll be a new hidden gem that people will not know about, and I, I don't know, let's, let's, let's just end it. But I hope you enjoyed and look forward to more. I'll keep playing until I hit a ending, I guess, for the demo. Or just figure out what the fuck is going on. So I hope you enjoyed, and if you did, please leave a like, comment, hit that subscribe button, become a full subscriber, hit the bell notification down below for updates on my videos. Thank you for watching, until the next time. Mm.